Oh, I will not ask you. Yeah. Uh, you when did you get back? This afternoon. Did you bring Blanche with you? Uh, no, I think she'll be a while yet. Yeah, my auntie's still really poor. Oh, hello, Shelley. When you're ready. Look at that. She sees a little rush on and she's off. I'll have words later on. I won't keep you a minute longer. It, it, don't you know what's been going on? Well, I'm sure you could fill me in on all the gossip if I was interested, Norris, but I'm not. <laughs> Dad, uh, uh, I need a word. Oh, hello, actually. Uh, hello, everyone. Um, can I have your attention, please? I've got a little announcement to make. Dad, look, this can't be. Just a minute, just a minute. All right. Um, I'm really glad that so many of you could make it. Um, a lot of you I know very well. Close friends and family, nearly. Quite a few of you are guests at my wedding. The happiest day of a girl's life, they say. <laughs> and if she's lucky, she finds a good one, and then she lives happily ever after. Well, my wedding day was the happiest day of my life. Oh, oh bless her, yes, it was. But unfortunately, I didn't find a good one. And I won't be living happily ever after. Oh, you all thought you saw me marrying Peter Barlow. The love of my life. So did I. But I wasn't. My marriage was a sham. You see, Peter neglected to tell me that he was still married to somebody else. Weren't you, Peter? To Lucy. Everyone, this is Lucy Barlow, Peter's secret wife. Hello. And this is Simon, Peter's secret son. <clears throat> Come on then, Peter, introduce me. There's no need for this. There's every need. I'm your wife. Uh, one of them. Oh, yeah, sorry, one of your wives. I should know all your friends and family. Has Peter never introduced Deirdre and Ken? No, I haven't had the pleasure. Peter. Look, this is daft. Just making a, a complete show of yourselves. No, we're making a show of you. This is your grandson, Simon. Dad, I, I'm, I'm sorry you had to find out like this. No, you're sorry they had to find out at all. Is it true? I would have invited you to the wedding, only I was led to believe you didn't approve. Of course, I can see now you just didn't know, did you? No. You still can't believe it, can you? Frankly, no, I can't. You're not the only one. Let's ask Peter to explain. Yeah, come on, Peter. Why did you do it? We're all dying to know. Was it a religious thing? Or was it a two-faced thing, you two-faced conniving little coward? Go on, good riddance, scumbag! Shelley, if this is true... Oh, it's true, all right. I am so sorry. We both are. Come on, I think we should go. You two make a hell of a double act. You missed all the fun, Bev. You okay? Yeah. yeah. What's going on? It's happy hour, Mum. Do you hear that, everyone? On happy hour. Two drinks for the price of one. Buy one, get one free. I know it's big of me, but that's the kind of landlady I am. Any other wives of Peter Barlow in tonight? No, Rita. If he comes at you with a ring, run for your life. 